Hey, it's Chris. Welcome to another rooftop mindfulness practice. We're out here on a cold November day. It's a bit windy, but this is what practicing mindfulness is like in the real world. So I think it's a good opportunity. Today's practice is going to be a sensory practice. So it's a good tool for focusing on living in the present and approaching life with a bit of curiosity. So you can pretty much be however you want to be for this practice. I'm going to sit on this little bench here. Um, but for, for this one, you could also lie down. Uh, you could also even do it standing if you wanted. Uh, nice thing to do standing in a window, maybe. Uh, just anything where we can be alert and awake. We're not going to sleep in this one. We're, we're really going to pay attention in a, in a very deliberate way. So however you want to be, get into that position. And we're going to start just for a moment by bringing a bit of attention to the breath. Not doing any kind of special breathing, just our regular breathing. And just making, getting into that kind of practice mode of, oh yeah, it's mindfulness. Going to pay attention to the breath again. It's a bit of a cliche, but a very useful tool because it's always there for us. And then we're going to start by looking, by using our, our eyes to see what we can see. If um, you've got limited eyesight, maybe, maybe you want to use your imagination for this bit. If that works for you. And the first thing I want you to do is take a really wide view. So try and take in everything you can see at once, not really focusing on one thing. Just trying to take it all in. Probably got a bit of a defocused gaze on the camera now as I try to take it all in. And then bring your gaze down to one specific object, just see what jumps out to you. Doesn't have to be anything special. Got a little tree just in my eye line that's going to work for me. But literally any object, you could do this with the simplest objects, you could do this with a button. And just try and really see it, not as, a, as an abstract concept of the button, as a tree or whatever it is, but the, the shapes, the textures, the colours. Trying to see things as if we were seeing them for the first time without all of those preconceptions. When we, we know what a button is, when we know what a tree is, we bring all of that to our experience so often and this we're trying to go back to a more childlike experience where we're seeing it with brand new eyes Now we're going to move on to sound, so if you feel comfortable doing so, this would be a great time to gently close the eyes so you, we're not letting ourselves get distracted, we're focused on, on what we can hear. Again, start by just trying to take all the sounds in at once. If there's no sounds, then Notice the, the lack of no sounds. But you might find that something comes up, even if it's not immediately obvious.
if you've got something, then let's zoom in to that sound. And again, try and hear it with new ears, not labeling it as, oh, that's traffic, that's bird song. But what is the sound like to hear? Is it constant or is it intermittent? What's the pitch like? What's the volume like? Now let's zoom out again and briefly try and take in all of the sounds we can hear. Then we're going to move over to smell. You can keep your eyes closed here or if you'd, you'd rather open them, you can do that. Closing is great because it helps us to focus. Or maybe just lowering the gaze a little will also work. Now just have a have a nose around. Can you can you smell anything? If not, what's it like to not smell anything? And then we'll move on to touch. So you're probably, you're standing, you're sitting, you're lying on something. What does that feel like? Again, discarding those labels of it's a floor, it's a chair, it's a mat. What does it feel like? Is it hard? Is it soft? Just checking in, seeing what it feels like. Now bring your attention back to the breath. Again, you can leave your eyes closed or if you want to blink them open, feel free to do that. And just take some nice breaths. Now, if you haven't opened your eyes yet, now's the time. Bring yourself back. Take a moment to ground yourself. Thank you for practicing with me today, and I hope to see you again soon.